Hello everyone. Today we will learn how to use add rotator control in ASP.NET. Add rotator control is used to make the rotating advertisement in ASP.NET. It displays the different different images whenever a user enters or refresh a page. So if you want to use add rotator control, all the information about your images, your advertisement will be stored in a XML file. So the first step which you need to do, you have to add this XML file. So I add this XML file here. The XML file must begin and end with the advertisement tag and that tag will be the root tag. Inside the advertisement tag, there will be several add tags which defines each add. So first of all, you need to add the root element advertisements. Inside the advertisements tag, you can add different different add tag to display a particular image. Now each add tag will contain different elements. So let's discuss the different element. The first element is image URL. The image URL is used that will be display the image. Means you need to mention the URL of that particular image. So the path of my image is this. The second element is navigate URL. The navigate URL element is basically used to display the link that will be followed when a user click the add. So I am navigating my user to particular page whenever the user will click on my add. The next element is alternate text. Alternate text, the text that will be display instead of picture if it can't display. So I am print a simple message, click here. Another important element is impressions. Impressions element is a number that indicates the weight of advertisement in schedule of rotation relative to other advertisement in a file. So it's, it will take a number. So these are the different elements that you can use for a particular ad. So for the other images, you need to repeat all the text. So you can add multiple ad tag depending upon your images. So for right now I have added three ad tag. It means it will display three images each time when a user will refresh a page. You can change the impression value as well. Now move to default page and add add rotator control. Add rotator control also have different attribute. You can set the height, width, And to giving this XML file link, you can you need to use alternate advertisement file. Now run your application and see how the advertisement will work. So each time when a user will refresh the page, it will display different different image. Thank you.